Jupiter Media presents Avasar Telecasting Global Opportunity. Hello and Namaste. Welcome to Avasar program. I'm your regular host Sunil Acharya, and the show is all about education, educational news, views, and interviews. Today I'm going to talk about study in India program. Why Nepali students have to choose Indian institution for their better career. There are lots of Indian university colleges who are really doing well and retaining international student and international market ways. Among these, BIMTEC, Birla Institute of Management Technology is one of the leading institutions in Delhi. Let's welcome the representative of BIMTEC, Birla Institute of Management Technology, who is none other than Dr. Haribam Chaturvedi, who is director of BIMTEC. Let's welcome him to the show. Dr. Chaturvedi, Namaste. you are welcome on our show. Namaste and thank you, Sunilji. Okay. It has been a very wonderful experience last year with the Zoom interview, and that was um, uh, telecast on our officer program, the same show. And students and parents are um, uh, giving very good response about that talk show as well. So this is the uh, uh, physical meet um, uh, first time, I think. This I'm is, very happy. Yeah. So first of all, would you please um, uh, give some information about your Nepal visit for this time? Uh, before COVID, uh, I have been uh, coming to Nepal for academic uh, programs like uh, conferences, uh, workshops, seminars. And uh, uh, I think uh, 12 years back, I have uh, delivered the convocation address at Purvanchal University. Viratnagar also. So I love to visit Nepal uh, for my uh, personal liking for the country as well as for my professional requirement. This time we have been uh, uh, invited by Banking, Finance and Insurance Institute of Nepal, BFIN, which is headed by Dr. Binod Atre, an eminent corporate trainer and management expert, to organize a uh, conference jointly on insurance industry challenges and opportunities. So this conference was organized uh, yesterday and uh, we four persons from BIMTEC, myself and my three senior colleagues, Professor Chaturaj, Professor Pandey and Professor Priyadarsi, they came and uh, we have addressed the conference, all of us, and uh, my colleagues have taken uh, three sessions separately also. It was concluded by the chairman of uh, Bhima Samiti, uh, which is uh, almost like India's Insurance Regulatory Development Agency, uh, Mr. Selwal. And uh, there was a very good participation of uh, the people from insurance industry and banking industry. Mm -hmm. All insurance companies were represented. And uh, I liked uh, the depth and seriousness among the insurance professionals. We talked about BIMTEC readiness to support Nepal's endeavor in some of the industries like banking and insurance. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, that was really nice experience, uh, Dr. Chaturvedi. So, uh, let's have a talk about um, uh, BIMTEC and Nepal relation. We have um, uh, more than 10 mature universities are here and promoting um, uh, um, uh, uh, Bachelor program and master program. How we can go collaboratively? Do you have any way out of uh, uh, in the near future? Yesterday, I yesterday and day before yesterday, I had a meeting with the uh, dean of uh, management at Pokhara University, uh, and uh, he is also uh, chairman of the insurance uh, reinsurance uh, central government's uh, reinsurance agency, and. Uh, uh, he's an old friend of BIMTEC and uh, uh, the, the senior person from the university nominated by the vice chancellor was also with him. So we discussed in length that how we can help the Pokhara University in launching uh, insurance programs and also developing insurance as a discipline. So they were very keen to have faculty and students exchanges. So we will have some more meetings on Zoom and we will work out for Pokhara University. Some of the private colleges we are supporting by sending our faculty to teach their students on a block basis. Our faculty visit Kathmandu and within 15 days or 10 days they teach the entire course. Mm -hmm. 
So whenever they find difficulty, they approach us and uh, uh, we help them and uh, we spare our faculty for 10 days. Uh, normally we do not allow in for any institution in India, but for Nepal we think that we should help. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much to know uh, about um, uh, the collaborative uh, steps uh, for Nepal. So let's have a talk about um, uh, BIMTEC, especially this program is education focused and students and parents are asking different questions about uh, BIMTEC. Uh, so how you uh, introduce BIMTEC um, uh, towards our uh, viewer? So for parents and students who are regularly uh, seeing the, your program and I have also been told that uh, uh, Mr. Sunil Achar's Absar program is very popular and he is a very prominent and respected career counsellor on TV screen. So I would like to tell them that if you have uh, uh, resources for teaching your sons and daughters and you want to provide them quality education, you should select uh, quality education in any part of the world wherever you can send. This is investment in future. I know that many parents from Nepal, they have been sending their daughters and sons to Europe and North America. But if you want to have a, another opportunity near to Nepal, lesser cost, then of, obviously India comes uh, for the students of Nepal. In management education, uh, India has very good institutions. And uh, out of 3,400 business schools, I will recommend that top 100 institutions are well equipped, well resourced, and uh, by studying there, their future will be safe and uh, they may get good placement also. So our institute is owned by Bidalas and uh, they have been running it for last 34 years. I am working at BIMTEC for last uh, 23 years as director. and. Uh, we have our own eminence among the top 20 institutions in our country and mostly among the private institutions we are rated high among top 10 institutions. So I will just say that we are really committed institution. Owners have no profit orientation because for them there are there is Bits Pilani, there is a Birla Global University at Bhavaneswar and Sarla Birla University at uh, uh, Ranchi, there are more than 150 public schools being run by Birlas only for charity, philanthropic purpose, but they believe in quality. So I can assure you that if you want to pursue management education, you can try, you can explore. Admission is not uh, available for every student, but of course meritorious, good quality students, there will be some opportunities like we have devised scholarship plan which can uh, reduce their, the tuition fees 50% to 100% depending upon the merit of the candidates. Okay. Being owned by Birla Institution, uh, how Birla uh, Institute of Management Technology graduate student can get benefit from uh, Birla's industrial area? There are uh, several benefits. Number one benefit is that uh, the Birla tag itself gives you identity. Mm -hmm. As a student, if you go to any company and say that I am from BIMTEC, I have done MBA from BIMTEC, they will definitely give you some consideration, knowing very well that Birla institutions are good. Mm -hmm. Bits plan is counted among one of the top five technology university of the country. And Birla schools spread all over the country, they are considered very good. And there is no capitation fees anywhere. There we believe some certain ethics and values. So, Birlas and Tatas and their institutions are considered uh, good institutions in our country. So having education from BIMTEC will definitely give an ass to this, the Nepali students. They can get good placement, they can get good summer training, they can go abroad, even there are 65 European and American B schools, our partner, if they want to pursue PhD from abroad, they can go there and they can pursue PhD studies. Our institute is also running a PhD program which is called Fellow Program and uh, it is similar to Fellow Program of IIMS. We are running it for last uh, 10 years. 
Okay. So, especially talking about the international student community in BIMTEC, how do BIMTEC welcoming international students and facilitating them? We have our international office. It is headed by a lady professor, Professor Dimisha Singh, headed and she is uh, assisted by our senior manager international relations, Ms. Pragyan Patnaik. Both of them have huge experience. Uh, Dimisha Singh has been in this field for last 20 years. Pragyan has also I think completed 12, 15 years and uh, uh, they know the requirement of uh, international students. Our office has a few other managers. They know their requirement, emotional and uh, uh, psychological requirement and uh, settling down them in India. They know how to settle down them, arranging their travels and uh, taking care of their personal problems, solving them immediately. Uh, this is the culture of our institute that foreign students who are coming from far off places, they are new to the place, we should help them and we should have empathy with them that they have come to our institute for far away places. Like uh, some African professors come for doing PhD at our institute, we love them, we like them, we guide them and we ensure that they should not face any difficulty or any problem at our institute. Moreover, our campus Culture is very open. We believe that uh, people from all nations, all religions, all uh, uh, nationalities, uh, they are they are same, and uh, there is there should be no discrimination. And we believe in discipline. So our never we have faced any problem when students from different parts of India. Like India is almost a union of many countries. Mm -hmm. It's a union of a state. So. It's a huge and there is a lot of cultural diversity like Nepal is having, although Nepal is a small country. So we never face any difficulty. Our students are very sensible. They, res they respect each other. Like uh, right now, Ramadan, the month of Ramadan is happening. The all Muslim students, they get uh, uh, their food at right time. And when Hindu students uh, do fasting during the Chatra, Navratri, they get food according to their choice and we celebrate all festivals. Hindu, Muslim, Sikh, Isai, all festivals are celebrated. Mm -hmm. Sometimes for foreign students we celebrate their national day. Mm -hmm. We invite ambassadors of foreign embassies. So if Nepali students, uh, we have uh, invited uh, once uh, in 2013 His Holiness Dalai Lama Mm -hmm. So at that time, uh, students from Nepal and Bhutan studying in NCR, they came in large number. Mm -hmm. And we give them, we gave them very warm welcome. And later they have conducted some of their meetings. They have a union, uh, Buddhist students and Bhutanese students. They have their students union. We have provided them place and fa facilitated them to conduct their meeting. Okay. So Nepalese students, they are like, they are very peaceful people and uh, they have been in India pursuing their studies for last uh, hundreds of years. Banaras Hindu University, Delhi University, Nehru University, name any university. You can find some students who became very good professional or good academician. Okay. So, especially BIMTEC has uh, plenty of options and opportunity for international students. So, what are the popular courses uh, there? Um, uh, which is chosen by the international students. I will. Uh, I would like to tell that uh, our we have four programs. The first program is our oldest flagship program, which is PGDM. It gives a specialization in marketing, finance, OBHR, operations, uh, business analytics, IT, ITES, banking, finance, insurance. So it it has a lot of uh, opportunities for students to go into any verticals of industry. So this is the most sought out after program of uh, BIMTECH. Uh, we received more than 6,000 applications. We have 400 seats. And uh, then second program we have uh, PGDM International Business. It is good for those who want to specialize or to join the international business sector, import and export. Third program is BIM BIMTEC is a very popular program which first time in India, BIMTEC has launched it. It is PGDM Insurance Business Management. It prepares uh, managers for insurance industry. 
and all insurance companies in India, they grab. We have only 60 seats and uh, you will find in all 45 companies, BIMTECH students are working there on good positions and many of them have become vice president or president. We launched it 20 years back and the fourth program is PGDM retail management. Students who are keen to join modern retailing, e-commerce, for them this retail management program is good. We are at the end of the session, so uh, we are quite happy that you are visiting here in Nepal, talking with different educational and academia, uh, and um, linking with um, uh, um, uh, um, uh, business, um, uh, insurance, finance, and industries. Thank you so much for your contribution. So finally, what's your message to the prospective students and parents, those who are trying to get the best institution in Delhi uh, regarding the BIMTECH? Yes, I can say only one thing that whosoever will join BIMTECH, we will embrace them, we will hug them, they will be our children, we will take care. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sunil ji. You are so nice okay. and so good to conduct this officer program for the students of Nepal. Thank, Thank you. you so much, sir. We are quite happy to having you so that we can explore the potential of BIMTECH here in local market. Hope BIMTECH will bring other paradigm to recruiting Nepali students in your future. Thank you so much. My pleasure, always. Our sir, telecasting global opportunity.